We will start with the evening practice. Evening practice, you simply lie down. And we lie down, we observe without name and the label. What it means? Look at the head and the neck. When you look at the head and the neck, uh, there is some sensation there, feeling is there. We are aware that it is still. Look inside the head. Any thought, just look at it. Any feeling, any sensation, So I'm turning the evening practice into a totally passive practice. Look at the right arm. So if I say look at the right arm, be there, where? On the right arm. Doing what? Doing nothing. So what happens, the pure awareness is there without any thinker because the thinker creates the label. And then we uh, simply experience the sensation, maybe stillness, maybe a kind of instant relaxation, maybe the energy movement there. Okay, whatever is happening. Left arm. Be there. Mm, You are there. And You awaken to the sensation, maybe a kind of relaxation. The beauty of all meditation is that the moment you separate yourself from the thinker and the thought, they are already separate. The moment you know that you can be aware without the thinker in the thinking. All the problems drops. I'm just pointing you to that. The rib cage, feel the rib cage. Sensation, relaxation and stillness. You know, the conditioned mind says, how, if I have not done anything, how can I go into relaxation? So thinker creates a lot of problem. So that's why we are observing, knowing, becoming aware without the name and the label. Name and label is a part of the thought associated with the feeling and emotions from the past, the belly, sensation and the relaxation. The right leg, or casually, you're looking at the right leg, casually but with awareness. So you awaken to some sensation, some stillness, 
some movement of energy, bubbling sensation, blood flow, a lot of things. Based on every time you do, there will be a different sensations. Left leg, sensation, relaxation, stillness, Uh, sensation, relaxation, stillness, energy, movement. It is the energy that moves the blood. We feel it. Sometimes we may feel the flow of the blood twitching. Oh, that may be very normal. Sometimes we feel sensations are more intense in one part of the body, in one set of muscles, and then the other. We're not doing anything. We start with the not doing anything in the evening practice. And breath awareness. Three point of breath awareness. I want you to reach to a certain level before we move into this breath awareness in a detail in an advance. Just look at the breath that is going in and out. Feeling the sensation, no change in the state of doing nothing. And that state is consciously helping you with a conscious experience of sensation, relaxation, stillness. You are simply aware of the breath that is going in and out. We are still in the mode of doing nothing with awareness of the breath going in and out, feeling the sensation and no change.
And now start counting the breath. The breath is going in, coming out. Only one change. Breath goes in, in one, out one, in two, out two. Recall, you forget you started in. You are carried away by any thought. You become aware. Return, do it again. We are counting the breath in that state of awareness of the stillness, sensation. Sometime it becomes deeper.
and return again to the three-point awareness of the breath where the counting is not there. In experience, the change or the difference, we started with the three-point awareness, we returned with that, the breath is going in and out, feeling the sensation, no change. In that state of sensation in the stillness, calmness, So if the counting helps us to maintain our awareness and attention of the deeper state, it is a helper. And gradually we progress. A oh, simple awareness of the breath also helps me to maintain the same state. We started with doing nothing and especially we became more and more aware of the physical in terms of the sensation. Now also we do nothing but this time We become aware of outside the space, the stillness in the body, the sensation. We are aware of the breath. We are also aware if there is any thought or a thinker. And we are aware of the inner space. If there is a simultaneous awareness of the inner and the outer, we succeeded in the mindfulness practice. That is a pointer. But again, another pointer We are aware of the inner space and we experience as if there is no me because there is no thinker. Thought may be there, but the thinker inside is not there, then the me is not there. And then we experience that sense of emptiness. It's not a dry thinking. It is a state. Become aware first that we are doing nothing. Good. And then become aware of the sensation, relaxation, calmness and the stillness. Then become aware of the outer space, inner space, and then become aware. Know me.
you can never have me without a thinker. And when there is no thinker, there is no me, there is only an awareness. And in that awareness, we experience the sense of what we say we know we are aware of the mindfulness another milestone in the journey to the mindfulness Sarve bhavantu sukhina, let everyone be happy. Sarve santu niramaya, let everyone be healthy. We include ourselves by default, a natural awareness. Sarve bhadrani pashyantu, let everyone be blessed. Ma kasche dukha bhag bhavet. Let everyone be free from the miseries in this world. Om shanti shanti shanti. Let there be peace, peace, peace. Bring your awareness on the right hand. Your awareness on the left hand. Take your time, bring both the palms on your eyes, open the eyes inside. Know your experiences. If you cannot do it, stay there.